Well, the moment of truth is almost upon us here. They are about to drop the puck. The Leafs start with possession as we are now underway. Dumps the puck in. Detroit's got it behind the net. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. And he regains control of the puck. And he gets in front of the slap shot to make the save. The Leafs move to the offensive zone. Detroit's got the puck. And he gets pummeled. He tried to protect himself by getting his stick up, but he didn't get it up far enough. He got rattled out of his hands. Now he's got to chase it down. Quick feed to Larkin. Poked away in the neutral zone by Matthews. Passes the puck over to Johns. Detroit's gained possession along the boards. Moves it around along the half wall. Broken up with a stick. The Red Wings ready to go on the attack. Nice feed from the right wing. In the offensive zone with the puck. You know he's thinking about his next milestone that's sitting one goal away. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Mata's got the puck behind the net. Here's a short pass to Fabry. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. Nice feed. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. Detroit's grabbed a hold of the puck. Gets it to the other point. And it goes off a stick and off to the side. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Fabry. Moves it to Riley. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Handles the puck. And that one's turned aside. The Red Wings have it against the wall. Passes it to Kopp. Here they come up along the wing. Stays with it. Great reactionary save as he gets a toe on that. Sliding across in the butterfly covers most of the bottom of the net. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kubelik. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Quick pass to Riley. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. Toronto's in now. Here's the chance, and he makes the save. Casa's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Oh, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Still looking for our first goal. The Red Wings win the draw. And it's a quick pass to Sundqvist. Sends it into the offensive zone. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. And now he moves it to Taves. Poked away at center by Sundqvist. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Slides it across to Ernie. Detroit's ready to go on the attack. Maintains possession. From the boards, he takes that pass. And now he angles it across to Pesic. Takes the puck. Right on the doorstep. How did he stop that one? He gets out right in front of that puck. It's in the low slot. He keeps himself big. There's no one for the puck to find a hole. Chris is great in the butterfly position, guys, and even when he's down, he maintains mobility to move with the play to make the save. That's his butterfly effect zone ability. Taken by Gostas Bear. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Larkin. Here's a shot. Gets a glove on it to make the save. Toronto's been able to play themselves to the top of the league standings with a consistent season. From the goaltender to the guys doing their scoring. It's been an excellent year. Camps won a big draw in their own end. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Perron. Takes a shot. Great reflexes as he comes up with the pad save. The Leafs carry it along the wall. Moves behind the net. Stopped by the goaltender. Slides it over with pace to Bunty. Denies him again. 
job's not done till the job's done. I mean, one save, not enough. Got to make another one, too. It's peppered with a couple of consecutive shots. Pokes it away in his own end. And now it's over to Mata. Puck picked up by Bertuzzi. Let's it go from the slot. Denies him in front. Puck grabbed by Gostas Bear. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Quick feed to Kemp. And the save. And he takes the feed. Here's a short pass to Perron. Let's see what the officials are calling. The Leafs are going to be shorthanded because of a tripping call. Guys, we know this power play is ranked toward the bottom of the league, but with their first power play of the game, this is a chance for them to turn things around. They've been working hard. They might be able to capitalize on some good things here and get the momentum swinging in their direction. And that puck leaves the zone. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Detroit's moving it along the wing. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Carries the puck up through center. And now it's grabbed by Bergeron. Here's a chance in front! And that's intercepted! Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Center in the front! He scores! What a play! The Red Wings get a late goal here in the opening frame. I like the way they played the last couple of minutes here and they're rewarded with the first goal of the game. Suitors one possession. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Here we go, pucks in deep. Here he is on the backhand. And he makes the save on that play. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Gets the puck in deep. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. And some good footwork to kick it away. Johns plays it along the wall. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Tries that last move. Maybe he should just shoot the puck or get it deep. Got a chase now. Centering feed. He scores! What an opportunity and delivers! In the final moments of this period, Detroit's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Puck scooped up by Mata. Quick shot! Grabs it with the glove. Crisp's confidence should be high, James. I mean, he's trailing in this game, sure, but he's coming off a shutout in his last start. Sider's known for his send it zone ability, guys. He throws those long breakout passes up the ice to spring his teammates. Johns moves so well with the puck, it's his wheel zone ability that makes him fly up the ice. I'll be watching these two players to see if one of them can really shine for their team tonight. Guys, back to you. Oh, and that's got the crowd buzzing after that stop. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Oh, that's a rattler. Did you hear those boards rattle? The Red Wings have it now. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Verona. Poked away in the neutral zone by Segris. Centering pass. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Takes the feed. Both teams getting a good sweat on after this first period. We've got lots more in store, and we're coming back with a clean sheet of ice next. Teams are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. 
Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Well, Razor, you've had some time to digest that opening 20 minutes. How do you assess things? The Leafs coaches can only hope that their guys found the start time for the second period better than they did for the first. They barely had the puck in that opening 20 minutes, and they're trailing the game as a result. Stick save by Pulsa. A chance out front. This is it off again here. It's in. It goes off the post and into the net. I've always thought we should be able to fix the goal post so every puck that hits the post somehow ends up in the net. Spoken like a true goal scorer. What a heck with the goalies. They got enough to flip it on. <laughs> Toronto's got new life here in this second period, right? It's amazing what a goal does. The energy on the bench changes. Guys can't wait to get on for their next shift. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Now a quick pass to Mata. Detroit's got the puck against the boys. And that pass goes awry. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Simple stop by Kosa. Oh, and another big stop! Tosses it on to Mata. Detroit's moving it into the offensive end. Takes a shot. Goalie with a stop. Crisp's gonna cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Leafs make their way back into the face-off circle, still in search of another goal. Taken by Ronick. Puck picked up by Voracek. Gaining momentum up along the side. Puck grabbed by Voracek. Standing tall with the save. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. They're trying to defend that lead aggressively, but they take a penalty. Now the penalty killers really have to do the job. Marner's getting a chance here on the power play, guys. He knows his zone ability can help them generate a good scoring chance. Let's see if they can strike. Toronto's won the faceoff. And that pass doesn't go. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Moves it to Latang. And he takes a shot. Great save by the goaltender who was in the right place at the right time. Marner's been on fire lately. His point streak's starting to stretch out. This is when you feel like you'll score any game. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Bergeron's won the draw and they'll look to set up. Stopped by the goaltender. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Grabbed along the boards by Latang. Sends the pass in front, and that's stopped. Toronto's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Fires it. Well saved made by Kosa. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? The Leafs win the face-off. Handles it along the blue line. Big save in front. It's a really good save. In tight, he shuts down the area where the puck can go by getting out onto the puck, and there's nowhere for the shooter to put it. And now he tries to get it across to Voracek. The Red Wings gain possession of the defensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Great stretch pass as he connects. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Hang. Gets the puck in deep. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Quick pass to Marner. Shot! Gives them nothing in front. Kosa's been a leader tonight. You don't need a speech, you need to play well. He's done that tonight, and he's kept his team right in it. Larkin's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Scores! And the power play goal puts us back to a tie game. All that work to try and get even, but you need the power play to help you out once in a while. They were 
were sharp, efficient, and now this game is tied with that power play marker. The Leafs win the draw here in the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Voracek. And that somehow stayed out of the net. Battling for it along the boards. Mata's moving the puck through his own zone. Slip feed. Chance in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Slides it over to Sider. Oh, that's poked away in the offensive zone by Voracek. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Poked away at center by Sider. The Red Wings looking against the half wall. Toronto's going on the attack as they gain the zone. Shot! Oh, he got paddled by Kosa. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. We are all tied up in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. Takes the feed. The Red Wings have it from their own end. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offense. The zone. They put the puck into the offensive end. Gets the puck over to Sherratt. Grabs it in his own end. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. And now he moves it to Fabry. And the puck departs the zone. Oh, textbook hook check to turn that over. Oh, I had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Hall. Hangs onto the puck. Hammers one at the net. Casa's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Larkins gained possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. Quick feed to Bertuzzi. And he puts that one aside with ease. Goalies love the butterfly. They know they've got a lot of the net covered, so he slides across. Doesn't worry about this shot. And now it's grabbed by Latang. the pass. Scooped up along the wall by Kent. Scores with a little added drink on the side. I like when the bottle goes up in the air, how angry the goalie gets. Like he slaps the bottle away. It's not the bottle's fault. Like stop the puck, man. Just the insult to injury with the bottle pop. See if we can pick up some momentum again here as a face-off is ready to go. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Shot from the wall. Dead eyes him on the play. Detroit's got it in their own zone. Puck dumped in. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. And it's kicked away. Picked up along the wall by Marner. Moves along the boards with some purpose. Throws it in. Detroit's gained possession along the boards. Take it along the wall by Hag. The Red Wings take it across the line. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Detroit's got a hold of it against the wall. Toronto's got it against the boards. Here's a short pass to Matthews. Koss is gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Leafs are looking to build on this one goal lead. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Detroit's looking to break out. And they send it right back to him. Moves it to Kubalik. Sean! Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. Oh, and they couldn't connect on the play. Dumps it in. The Red Wings have it against the wall. The Leafs have it in the offensive zone. He scores! Aye, aye, captain! Toronto's looking to...
to cruise into the intermission with a two-goal cushion. Well, they're feeling a lot better than they were 30 seconds ago. This is a nice spot for them to be in. Detroit's won it. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Poked away in the neutral zone by Ronick. Dishes it to Fabry. Oh, and they probably want to redo on that. Oh, quick save. There's another stop. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Moments away from the faceoff. Let's get back to the action. The Leafs win the draw. Moves it to the middle. Picked off in front. The Red Wings move it ahead. Fires it on net. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps it at bay. Does it again with the stop. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Chris's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James, he needed a cover there. Getting into the later stages of this period. The Leafs have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Nearing the 40-minute mark of the game. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Bertuzzi. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Quick pass to Kerfoot. They gain the zone from the left side. Here's a shot. Oh, what a save in front. And he takes the dish. Well, two periods down and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. for period number three is ready to go. And the puck is dropped and we are underway here in the third. We've got 40 minutes in the books. Ray Ferraro is between the benches. Ray, how do you see things playing out? The Leafs are ahead in a game that has no defense in it. So if you can't defend, you better keep scoring. That's got to be the plan here tonight. Nice pass. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Grabbed along the boards by Bertuzzi. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Marner. And that's turned aside. And now he angles it across to Perron. Toronto's got the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Poked away at center by Larkin. Slides the pass over to Sider. Detroit's across the blue line. Passes it in front. Scores! What a finish on the play! Detroit's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. has dropped and we are back underway across the line along the left wall sends it in on the attack moves it quickly over to Sherratt handles the pass quick feed to Fabry point shot off the outside of the post and stays out Detroit's bench has a collective groan here that shot hits the post and stays out they're trying to work their way back Play blown dead, let's get the call. This game weighs heavy on the penalty killer's shoulders now. They're down a goal and they have to keep it right there as they're short a player now. They were working on this in practice and we've seen them have success during the games with it as well. Really simple view. Puck to the point, unload the big shot and then get there for rebounds. Pissick slugging the puck. Toronto's got it from behind the net. Bergeron's picking up momentum through center. Sends it out front. And he denies that great opportunity there. 
Here's a short pass to Bergeron. Picked up along the boards by Riley. Moves it to Latang. Blocked in traffic. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. That's moved up ahead. Shot, and that's blocked from someone in front. Quick pass to Riley. Takes the feed at the point. Gains control of the puck here at the blue line. And that's knocked away by Hall. The Red Wings gain control of the puck against the wall. That's off a stick. Skaters go off for a line change here on this power play. Feed to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Gives him a whack and the officials are going to call this one. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. Four checks going off to the box for two minutes. A little more room out there with a little four-on-four. Four. The last couple of years, we've seen different strategy four-on-four four come into the game. What is apparent, when you get the puck, you keep it. You'll move it and hold it till the great chance opens up. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Puts it on net, comes up with the stop. Casa's got the puck. Boy, he's been under fire tonight. Been really sharp, and in a close game, you can't make a mistake that costs a critical goal. Still lots of time left here in this frame. This one has been a good back and forth contest. We're sitting with a 4-3 hockey game. Here he is, shot right in front. Came up with the save on that play. Sends the pass over. Tosses it to Raymond. Moves it quickly over to Larkin. Toronto's got the puck in their own end. Detroit's got it behind the net. The Leafs get a hold of the puck. Taken by Klingberg. It's an opportunity for the power play unit to go to work now as the penalty expires. Quick shot. Oh, how did that stay out? What a save by Kosa. Raymond's got it along the boards. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a shot. And he comes up with it. Whoa, scores! And just like that, we are all tied up thanks to that power play goal. I mean, the goal's awesome, James, but they had to earn that power play. They had shift over shift, started to put a little pressure on, felt like there was going to be either a goal or a penalty. They get the power play and then don't miss. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck off the draw. Fires it into the offensive zone. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Bergeron's been whacked on the play. The official's arm is up in the air. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Hey, this was one of my favorites, James. The old slashing penalty. I took a few of those in the day. Matthews wants to help his club score on the power play here, guys. One way he can do that is by using his zone ability like we've talked about. It can help him get a good look. So let's see what he can do. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. And a smart heads up play with the bank. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Leafs have it now. Quick feed to Marner. Can't find his man. There's a solid collision. Here's a short pass to Bertuzzi. On the attack along the boards. The Leafs gain control of the puck. Marner's into the offensive zone now on the attack. From one end of the blue line to the other. Oh, he had a beat, but it goes off the inside post. The Leafs have had nothing but bad luck. Another one. My word, they've really got them hemmed in here in their own zone. Over the half wall. Another pass. Oh, but another big time clutch stop. Looking to clear it here in the defensive zone. What pressure here in the offensive end. Trying to get it out. And they're able to get it out and finally get a breather. 
The Leafs gain possession. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Slides it quickly to Suter. And here at center, that's intercepted. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Paul's part of a very good power play. They're on one again. He's already got one power play goal tonight. And he slides it quickly to Riley. Raymond's up at the box. And the puck's knocked loose. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Hall's crossed the line and gained the zone. Raymond's back out onto the ice as we are back to even strength here. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. Here he is with the backhander. Oh, what a quick stop. The goalie reads his play really well. He gets out aggressively to make the save. That's a low slot shot. It happens quick, but he's in the right spot to make that save. More than half the period has expired. And it's all tied up. Detroit's won the draw. And now it's over to Fabry. Oh, what a glove save! And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers strummed up. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Oh, making his presence felt with a hit. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Bergeron. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And that's intercepted by Pissick. Moves it to Verona. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Quick pass to Bergeron. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. And he takes the feed. Moves it quickly over to Verona. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Quick feed to Raymond. He scores! Breaks the deadlock! Really good play at the net. And now somebody's got a lead, and we'll see if they can increase it. The Red Wings have been in a dogfight tonight, and they have finally scratched and clawed ahead. I don't think the fight's over yet, and they're going to have to play aggressively and not be too conservative, as there's still some time left. Toronto's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. What save! Koss has got it, and he'll elect for the whistle. Jumped on it pretty quickly there, and like everything else tonight, he's really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. Past the midway mark of the frame, Detroit's been the better-looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one-goal lead. Scooped up along the wall by Sider. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Oh, it's denied by Kosa. Made the stop on that play. Kosa's got excellent positioning here to make that stop. I don't think if he's in good shape positionally, he even comes close to this. Oh, these are the games I love, James. You know I always talk about how much I like offense. A one nothing game's great, but these wild, high-scoring affairs, they're the most fun to call and by far the most fun to play in. The Leafs will play it in their own end. They go on the attack from the left side. And now he tries to get it across to Latang. Shot off the club and makes the save. Made the stop on the play. He's like a backboard in there. Bang, bang, the puck's off him twice. He makes two stops. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Feeds it over to Gostaspair. The Red Wings look to start the transition game. Puck scooped up by Mata. Sends it over to Kopp. That's a good play. He chips it into the offensive zone now. He can get after it. Try and run some time off the clock here. This is where you want to play defense. Takes the feed from the left side. Almost down to the final minute here in this third. Moves it to Mata. Puck 
Picked up by Zadina. The Red Wings take it along the wing. He probably wouldn't make that play about 10 minutes ago, but now with a lead in the dying moments of the game, that's a safe, smart play. Here's a short pass to Taves. They need a goal here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice. Toronto's got the puck. Receives the pass. Here's a chance. And that goes off a body. Puck grabbed by Perron. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Oh, and a nice play to free up the puck there. Quick pass to Kopp. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Can't make it work. And offside, we'll get a reset here. Check in with our own Carlin Bade. Who had the better night in that head-to-head -head matchup with the Stars? Sider's been great at generating offense, and I've been impressed with his game in this one, guys. The Leafs win the faceoff. That's all she wrote from this one. The unpredictability of that first period, James, seemed to set up for a wild game. Then it just settled in. It was crazy. But yet, it kind of ended right after the first 20. Nevertheless, we got a final. Hooray, Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.